Hi, this is Lizzie from Mozalingua. The idea that children are better language learners than adults is probably as old as the proverb that says you can't teach an old dog new tricks. But when it comes to language learning, is this popular belief really correct? Or is it simply another common misconception? Meet me out on the play field and let's find out. Before I get started, one question for you. Have you subscribed to our channel yet? If you have, great. If not, what are you waiting for? Click the big button down below so you not miss any of our videos with great tips and hacks to learn languages. And if you're watching this video on Facebook or other social platform, don't forget to like it and follow our page. First, to make things clear, today's game is about the ability to successfully communicate in a foreign language, not about being bilingual or being able to talk like a native speaker. Because, let's face it, we're not planning to become international spies. Most of us just want to communicate properly in a foreign language, right? So, when the goal is learning a foreign language, let's play the game and see who really scores higher. Yes, children are like sponges. You've probably heard that one before. And we actually can't deny that children do learn quickly. There are quite a few theories to explain that. But basically, scientists agree that children's brains are simply faster at absorbing new information. It's just something that kids do unconsciously. Well, one point for the little ones. Adults, on the other hand, are better at making associations and links. And that can be a powerful tool when you learn a language. Connecting ideas in a more complex way is a skill that helps adults integrate new concepts into their pre-existing cognitive structures more easily. So, they are the ones who score now. Besides, growing up makes us continually face new situations and challenges that require good communication skills. Otherwise, how would we manage the oral presentations at school, our first job interviews, or even proposing to someone or getting proposed to? This naturally makes adults more prepared to communicate and to express themselves. And this is also the reason why older people might even learn languages faster. So again, a few more miles in the odometer of life might be a good thing. But when it comes to lack of inhibition, children score another point. While adults are usually afraid of making mistakes or saying the wrong thing and being judged for it, kids are free from these pressures and are hardly ashamed of opening their mouths to speak. Tie game. Pronunciation seems to be another area in which the little ones outscore us. First, because children are usually better at mimicking new sounds. Second, because they also tend to be more skilled at identifying subtle differences in sounds, which makes easier for them to pronounce a new language correctly from the very beginning. So, the younger a child is, when they begin learning a second language, the better their pronunciation will be. But grown-ups have already mastered their own native language, so they are more familiar with more advanced elements of grammar and syntax. And this gives us a better understanding of how a language works and, of course, another point on our scoreboard. An important social aspect that usually falls in favor of children is time. When it comes to learning a second or a third language, most kids do it at home because their parents speak those languages. And, of course, the more exposure you get to a language, the better and the faster you learn it. So, for three youngsters. Although it varies from person to person, children and teenagers tend to have a lower rate of retention, a skill that is paramount when you want to learn a new language. And they also tend to be less focused than adults. Common attention span estimates range from about 5 minutes for a 2-year-old to a maximum of 18 to 20 minutes in teenagers and adults. So, grown-ups score yet another point. Last but not least, another important aspect to consider when it comes to language learning is, as all of us here at Mozalingua usually point out, motivation. Unlike kids that sometimes are forced to learn a new language at school, most adults 
actually learn a second language because they want to or because they need to in order to achieve something they want. So again, those of us who have blown out a few more candles will shoot, score and win this match. Well, if you've always dreamed of learning a second or a third language, but keep telling yourself that those days are gone, I hope I've convinced you to think again. Don't wait any longer. Check this video's description to find a few good tools to start right away. And happy learning! If you learned something new from this video, give it a thumbs up. Then hit subscribe and turn on your notifications. Have a look around our channel for more hacks and tips. And if you're watching on another social media platform, like or follow our page. See you next time.